hi pals welcome back to my youtube channel in today's episode we are going on a tour to see an abandoned street walker aboard Guys, the history why this mansion was abandoned will literally make you cry. Look at this house, it does not look abandoned when viewed from afar. Join me guys as we step inside this jewelry abode to see what's left behind. This is crazy, all the stuffs in this china cabinet, whoever lived here were probably big drinkers, I must say. Cool. This common room is cozy with a modern like fireplace. Oh my gosh, this is amazing, well tiled lavatory from the bottom to the top, it looks cool. Wow, this superior staircase is really in a dilapidated state. Mind to living room. Look at that, guys. The family that lived in this mansion must be wealthy. Look at that pretty pink crown moldings. So lovely. Let's take a look at the main kitchen. Guys, the structure of this house is something else. Look at those pots made with copper still hanging on the wall. Oh my god. This is the master's bedroom. It's really small compared to what I expected to see. Wow, nice color combination. Guys, it might interest you to know that this house was used to film adult films. It used to be a home for a husband and a wife with a daughter and a son. The wife suffered from breast cancer, which later took her life in the year 2010. Since then, Life never went back to normal for the family. After the death of his wife, he ventured into amateur adult films. When I was exploring the history behind the abandonment of this mansion, I got to the point where he started participating in porn movies. I was dumbfounded. Why? Because I began to question myself out of a million and 1,000 jobs out there, why venture in adult films? 
this will eventually break the heart of his wife wherever she is. Do you know guys, he was making huge money from this business because he had two shops where he used to sell party items. He was doing perfectly well in his adult film business. He used to lure modest beautiful ladies to his house either by drugging the ladies or he uses force on them. Also, he used to entice some of the ladies with his money until the local authorities caught up with him. What this man does when he succeeds in luring and enticing the ladies to his house, he usually films his sexual acts with them secretly. Thereafter, he sells the tapes. His luck took a dark turn when the local authorities was informed of his illegal sexual exploitations. Immediately, the authorities got this information. His house was descended on. When the local authorities searched his house, they found lots of cocaine and thousands of homemade sex tapes of his victims. He was charged and sentenced to six months in jail due to the bad reputation this ugly event has cost him, coupled with debts he owed, he was forced to travel far away, leaving everything inside this mansion abandoned. These are all porn tapes and they are homemade videos. For privacy sake, the title of these tapes will not be shown. This lounge area is really looking nice. The chandelier looks old. The rug is a cheap one, but the sofa was made with high quality leather. Look, guys, a serving tray. This is classy. Oh no, look at that mold on the wall to the ceiling, this is terrible. Holy shit, this wall is completely damaged with mold.
Wow, this is amazing. Giant gorilla. This gorilla is as big as the size of a human. Lots of abandoned stuffs. This room looks like it was used as a storage room. There are lots of files and books in here. Look at this fish tank. Oh my goodness. It's so huge, guys. This kitchen area is small and in a terrible condition. Nice room. It's neat and literally untouched with the classy chandelier pretty taxidermy bird guys look at these statues so clean and untouched what a creepy looking animal Whoa, this is scary. Everything in this room is still well placed. Lots of wine glasses, champagne glasses, all in spotless condition. This could be a photo of his wife who died of breast cancer. The owner of this house must have spent lots of money to put this house in this way. Come on guys. Let's explore the rooms upstairs. So cool. Lovely straw hat. This is the basement area. Wow! Lots of stuffs packed in here. Whoa! This is amazing! A fully packed wine vault. All these wine bottles has not been opened.
Look guys, there is an ambulance. The man that owned this house must have been swimming in so much money to own an ambulance in his house. Guys, this is the swimming pool area. He also had a boat. Wow! Thanks for watching, pals. Please subscribe to this channel and turn on your notification button to be part of this thriving family.